The first time I stepped off the airplane, there were government people there, there was Bonarians there, there were Americans there. And I was so impressed that they cared about the United States wounded warriors. The first person I shook hands with was a young man dressed in a suit in 100 degrees weather. I said, this guy's nuts. His brow was covered with sweat. I said, God, God bless him. He's, he's nuts. But when I shook his hand, I could feel his strength. I could feel his kindness. And I could feel his love for his country. I said, how could he wear that suit in the heat? After talking to other people on the tarmac, they told me that his uh, name was uh, Lieutenant Governor Herbert Domo Kasi. I said, wow, I just met the Lieutenant Governor of another country. <clears throat> but with a tear in my eye, after everything was done on the tarmac, I walked over to him and I shook his hand and I thanked him for welcoming welcoming the American soldiers here to Bonaire. As I walked away, it struck me. The shoot suit showed his respect for his office, for his country, and for the group of people that he was welcoming. Herbert, by wearing that suit in the heat, taught me respect. When invited to the governor's residence for dinner, I know I'm a little nutty because he's a little bit nutty. I put on a suit <laughs> to respect him and his, and his office. Without a word being talked between us about it, Herbert Domokasi taught me respect. Thank you, Herbie.